Alright everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be playing Poppy Playtime. I, I just want to let everyone know that I have seen gameplay of this, so it's not my first time, but as you all know, playing a game is way different than uh, watching it. So we're just going to see how it feels, and I'm going to be doing my first reaction to Chapter 2 whenever that comes out. So, without further ado, let's go, and holy shit, this guy looks way scarier when you're actually playing the game. Oh my god. So yeah, we already know what this uh, new game. So yeah, I just want to go through a couple of theories while we're going through the game as well. Because this game is giving me the same feeling. Oh shit, I'll be quiet in case you haven't seen this. You are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Hard to believe? Just watch. Poppy Playtime! Poppy's as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love you. Can you help me polish my shoes? Why, of course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect! Thank you. Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it. And smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Poppy? I'm a real girl. Just like you. What's the time? Playtime! Playtime! And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just $2.99 a person. An entire hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. We can't... Alright, here we go. Dude, yeah, I was saying, this is the most excited I've been for an indie game in a while. Probably since Five Nights at Freddy's. Yeah, so if you haven't seen this, you're going to be in for a ride. I've seen this, but, uh, yeah, this game's pretty cool. I cannot wait for Chapter 2. Hopefully there's, like, a crap ton of chapters. Now, I did want to go through a couple of theories with everyone, especially when we get to one scene. I'll show you guys. Whoa. This game looks amazing when you're... Okay, escape, pause. All right. Yeah, this game looks absolutely beautiful when you're actually playing it on your own hardware because when you're watching it on a video you don't know how like scaled down it is or how they uploaded it let's grab that yeah, how the hell you grab stuff see like this is the different it's like the learning curve how the hell you grab shit excuse me sir what are the controls dude <laughs> Run, shift, move, crouch, pause, interact. Really, it's E, dude. Oh my god. That sound, by the way, most satisfying sound I've heard in a while. Play this. Hi, my name is Leif Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, will turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And that's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. No spoilers. So, you've got my warning. It's not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. Alright, so yeah. The lore in this game is absolutely amazing. People don't really know what's going on because it's only the first chapter, but you can probably tell once it gets to more chapters, it's going to get nuts. Alright, and if you wanted to figure out how to solve the first puzzle, you have to look at this train. It's just the colors on the, uh, the thing. So red, pink, yellow, red. Wait, what? No, green, pink, yellow, red. Why the hell did I say whatever? Green, pink, yellow, red. 
So yeah, we're gonna go through this, and I'm just gonna cut- When we get to the scene, I'll start talking about theories, but right now, I'll just play through. Wait, what was it? It was green... Green, pink... I'm so dumb. I am so dumb. <laughs> green, pink, yellow, red. There we are. Now we have to watch this tape. Alrighty. But yeah, I've been obsessed with this game. I just bought it yesterday. So. Yeah, let, let's, let's not take their head off in this playthrough, that would be amazing. Man, this is pretty loud. I, I might have to turn down for you guys, <laughs> holy crap. Yeah, what's the time? Play time. Alright, let's go, let's grab this. Now, I'm really interested to see how this actually plays, because I've seen it, but I actually haven't actually used it. So, hand. Fire and let go. Okay, you don't need to hold it, you just press it. Alright, cool. God, dude, this game looks nuts. What engine is this on? Alright, hand. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen, the meme himself. Taking in the scenery, holy shit! But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna recommend literally anyone to try this game because the atmosphere in this game is ridiculous. Yep, and he grabs the key. Let's grab that. Uh, power room. Key. All right. Man, why the hell is it E? It's so weird. Everyone always puts it E, it should just be F. Alright. Where the hell is this power thing again? Okay. Okay, now this? I, I didn't remember the puzzles. You just go here and then... Yeah. Oh, holy frame rate. Oh, of course this big man's gone. Why wouldn't he be? See, how come he... See, how? why is there a red hand there? I can't even get it. Oh. Look, I'm slithering. E. Fuck this hallway. Oh, dude, I've seen that. Why did Why did that make me jump? I can run. I forgot. I don't know if we're gonna get all the tapes. I might as well to show it to everyone if they haven't seen it. Right, let's get let's grab that. I think the rest are down here. Excuse me, sir. Give me up. All right. Oh, we need to hold it. Alright, I think there's a couple more in here. But yeah, a uh, couple of theories. The first theory I wanted to talk about was... When you look into a certain scene, you can look down, and there's like all these swirly, like, 
pipes and shit. I have to be there to show you. I can't start explaining this without, like, the visual. Or else it's gonna sound weird. Alright, where are these other, uh... Things? I open this. Alright, calm down, calm down. So which colors are you... Okay, I got the green one. Okay, so they must be still back here. I know I've seen the gameplay, but I've only seen like one or two videos. Alright, let's get that. Beep. And I know the last one's up here. Or not, it's not up here. Where is it? Wait, seriously though, where where is the last one? Oh, it's up there, of course. Beep. Dude, that's that I'm telling you, dude, that sound is so satisfying. Please do not remove that if you if you're watching this. Mob games. Of course not gonna be watching this, but you never know. Uh put these in. Let's get the frame rate back, please. It's only in this room where it's only framing me. I don't get that. Alright, let's grab this. Now we have two hands. Let's go. No, not in the box. Nope, not in the box. God damn it. All right. The fuck do you crouch, dude? Okay, there we go. You gotta hold control. I gotta remember that so I don't like get fucked. Okay, there's the two. Do not enter. Yeah, no, and I gotta get around here. And I gotta go through. There's the two. Yeah, I definitely remember this one. This one's. Oh. Going up the slide of doom. How was that? Oh, I forgot to get. Oh, dude, I forgot to get the other tape. Oh, whatever. Needs power. Yeah. Let me go up these stairs. There's the tape. Now, are we there yet to where I can start talking about this theory, or is... No, I'm not here yet. Alright. All right, there's, there's the one. Whoa. For whatever reason, it's like really framey up here. I don't know what that is. Alright, let's grab that. Oh, you son of a bitch. There's another platform. I have to get over there, of course. Alright. Wait. Alright, bring that over here. Wait, I need that to be here. What? Excuse me. Oh, wait, can I move it when it's... Okay, grab that. Grab. No, I mean, grab this and pull it over here. Alright, boom, there we go. Okay, grab 
this, this. You son of a bitch, dude. Dude, this one is actually kinda... Alright, actually, here we go. Boom, fall. Ouch, alright. Boink. Jesus, why that's so loud? Wasn't that loud when I freaking watched one of the game plays? Holy crap. this shit going. We're almost to the place where I can start talking about theories. But how's your guys' day been going? You wanna know how mine's been going? My ears hurt from the, how loud this is. That is definitely a build a bear rip off. Oh, I thought I lit up his eyes. That was just a thing going. You have to sit through this whole animation, dude. Give me that. Alright. Alright, here's where shit's about to go down. Oh my god. Dude, this guy looks nuts in this fucking graphics. Holy fuck. Oh, we're just gonna get out of here. Oh, fuck. Run, 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 you motherfucker. Run! Keep running, keep running, go, 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 go. Don't stop, keep running, bit. Oh my god, keep fucking running, go! This motherfucker's right behind me. Oh my god, run! Run, run. Oh shit. Uh, uh. This is so fucking anxiety inducing, holy shit. Run, bitch, go! <laughs> Holy fuck. Go! Yeah, bitch. Suck a cock. But yeah, this is this is where we want to start talking about the theories, alright? Here, look. Look at how deep down this goes. Like, what is the most logical answer to where you're going to go next in the next chapter? It would just be down, right? Because you have... Look at how deep... Like, you don't even see the bottom. And by the way, that guy... There, there's no way he's dead. Just because you see a couple blood splatters on a pipe does not mean he's dead. For all we know, there could be, like, balloons down there. He landed on a bunch of balloons, but we'll see. Yeah, anyway, that's my theory. I think we're just going to keep going down. I think this factory just keeps going. I mean, look, at, look, there's clouds in a factory. How the hell does that even happen? All right, let's get through this. This looks nuts, though. When they're actually playing. I'll grab this safe because I know where this one is. Final log. 
in relation experiment 1006 the prototype coordination and cooperation is evidently within his skill set as well as the skill set of all other experiments of his type though still missing today's events are no doubt in relation to him his absence was a flaw in the scientific process which should have under no circumstances been left unaccounted for that's why I'm making this log so that the same mistake won't be made twice. Any future experiments will need to be contained and disposed of in a secure location. I'm not worried about myself. One breakthrough and I'll be back. We must forge onwards in the name of science. Whether those who are beneath us understand it or not, end of- Yeah, so that man got slaughtered by that, by a huggy dude. I don't know, I keep referencing huggy as just him, which I just need to start calling him by his name, so I get used to it. But yeah, holy crap. But yeah, anyone's guess as good as anyone's where we're going in the next chapter. But I will be doing my reaction to it. I really want to see what this game has to offer. Yeah, danger, run, I don't think so. <laughs> you can jump down the stairs. Definitely I'm burning my ankles. Yeah, I get yeeted. Hello. Ooh. And... Jesus. You opened my case. But yeah, that's gonna be... Well, that's chapter one, if you guys haven't seen it. Like I said, I already seen gameplay of it, but... Dude, I just cannot wait for chapter two. This game's been on my mind. Like, this is like the same amount of hype as uh, Five Nights at Freddy's when that came out. But, uh, that's gonna be it. Thanks for watching.